Oh, you got a fridgy. My family calls it my superpower. It's my ability to see value in things that I can buy and flip for a profit. I'm the Crazy Wife Lady and welcome to my channel. We are here today at the Goodwill. It is a Friday. I've noticed that on Fridays the pickings are usually pretty slim. But we're gonna head in today and see what we can find that we can buy and look for a profit. So here we go. Look at that guy. He's pretty cool. He looks kind of like a uh, Anderson pottery, but he's polar bear studio statue. Polar bear statue, not studio. I'm like. <laughs> Is that a studio dedicated to just making polar bears? That's pretty <laughs> impressive. Only polar, only polar bears, sorry. Oh, look at that vase. That's a pretty vase. $6.99. Pure one, $14.99 originally. That's kind of pretty though. I that like, like that. Cactus. It does kind of look like a cactus. It has an original price tag of $14.99. Yeah. But I kind of like it, even though it is Pier 1. Pier 1 isn't in business anymore. It's very sad after in some places. <laughs> That's what I hear. Yeah. I feel like I'm still going to buy that because I just... The I know, and I still like it stylistically, so I think I'm going to buy it. Oh wait, no I'm not. It's got a chip. It's got a chip. I fun sponged myself. Never mind. Look, I found this for you. Eight million of those. I know you. Shed. That does not surprise me at all. Oh, but look, it has a mushroom on it. <laughs> Who is this? Jasco Taiwan. Who do you think makes this giant vase? FTD. Oh. Brinco. Very close, though. I feel like that was a close guess. That was a that was a good guess. Look at the Merry Christmas owls. There may have been a Made in China sticker there on the bottom. They're very sweet little owls. They kind of remind me of the weather owls, oh, yes, don't they? they? Do. Yeah, it does. It does. Yes. That's the weather owls at Christmas time. Yes. <laughs> and when you peel the sticker here, it looks like they put it over. A st see that little sticker there? Yeah. I think that's a Made in China sticker. I like owls. I think we'll grab that for $2.99. What did you find? I found a little kitty cat. I think it's a fox. I found a little fox. <laughs> Same difference. I found a feline. I guess it could go either way. It's either a fox or a cat. Mm -hmm. Or a long-haired dog. I like him. He's cute. It could also be a thing, right? It could be I. Oh, look what I found for Jenny. Well, you were distracted. I found these dolphins going through hoops. Well, we have dolphins. He's going through hoops? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's a different box. Who makes this? Oh, that's cool. Oh, Fiesta. Fiesta. Is that the mi oh no those are too stacked? I was gonna say is that the mixer? The mixer and the glasses, but no. Looks like Homer Laughlin. Did you find art? Oh, I found an owl art with button eyes. That looks like one of those uh, wine and paints. Yes. But they did, they actually did a good job. I have to give them props. I mean, if that was mine, I would definitely hang it in my house. Sure, because you worked hard on it. But I'm not that good, so it probably <laughs> <laughs> It's not, it would not be mine. Scoping out the cart, scoping out the cart. And... <laughs> that is sex in the city. I is guarantee they, it. Is this when they go to Europe? Yeah. They, they just forgot to yacht? put that on the box. They It'll just put Mr. Big low. and they forgot the <laughs> subtitle of Sex in the City. <laughs> I think you're right. I, I am right. What about this I'm one? I'm always right. This one is also <laughs> Sex in the <laughs> City. <laughs> Hang on, Harvey edition. <laughs> <laughs> That's 
a cute little uh, milk glass piece. Never seen. Have you ever seen a milk glass cradle? I just got an acro. I get blue cradle. No, but it's a planner and it's rectangles. Not even a plan. <laughs> it's not even white or gray or milk glass. <laughs> Where did bragging. that come from? I'm just bragging what I found. <laughs> Put some art glass on the shelf here. This looks like a contemporary piece. It's a nice piece. Possibly home goods or something. Six ninety nine. Uh, if it was signed and it was an artist piece, I would be willing to pay six ninety nine for it. But I think I'm gonna pass. What is this? This is like a foam piece. This is like those owls. Foam owls. Yeah, only it's a horse. And this is kind of an interesting box. It must be for a candle. Dagny, you missed one. He was hiding on the end cap. California Glass Studio. What do you think this is? Oh. An oil lamp? Although there's no way to add oil, except I guess you pour it and then put a wick in. Hummingbird feeder, but no. It's pretty. It is pretty. I like the iridescent. Is it an incense burner? I don't know. I mean, technically you could. You could, put, you could stick anything in that hole. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> You, you had to go. I knew. I knew if I left it open. Yeah, but I just... Right in. <laughs> Thanks for coming. I'm here all week. <laughs> I don't want to buy that. I found you another chalkware piece to go with your stuff the other day. Actually, this one's ceramic. It doesn't go with your holy family? Okay, sorry. Oh, look. Possibly left in. And there's two. There's one with its eyes closed and they're broken. <laughs> no. Darn it. They're both broken. That's so disappointing because they're so adorable. They're both, they might actually be Joseph's originals. They're both broken. There would have been something here and there would have been something here. So sweet. It makes me a little sad. I'm tempted to buy them and sell them together, but they're $1.99 each. You know what? I'm sure somebody will come along and see those and buy them for themselves just to have in their own home. So I'm going to pass on those because of the break. Photograph. what that is. I'm a little tempted to pull off the sticker and see what that says underneath. Looks like it might have some age to it. It looks kind of like um, Fiesta. So it looks to say N52 and I'm not sure what that means but I like it. So we're gonna stick it in the cart. We've got three items in our cart. <laughs> kind of a slow start. This is kind of a nice art. Well, I was going to say art pottery, and then I turned it over. I was like, nope, that's not art pottery. That looks like something that was sold at possibly Target or something, the way it's made. <laughs> All right. What is happening here? Made in China. <laughs> We've got cats suspended in this snow globe. It's kind of weird. Hobnail green bell. Unfortunately, the little dingler is missing on that. Oh, you got a fridgy. It's free. It's free. There's no price. Oh my god. And it's in really good condition. I can't fist bump that. Mm -hmm. Pyrex Red Friggy. 
see if there's any chippies. I wonder if it's free because it came in a set and the rest of the set is creeping somewhere. Oh, it is in good shape. Yeah. Yeah. And this Goodwill prices things at the checkout. Oh, we better find the rest of them. Let's Quick. Search. I was looking for your Seek candlestick. and search. <laughs> I was looking for your candlestick. <sighs> I still need to find the candlestick, by the way. This reindeer, maybe. It's really cute. Pier 1. Of course, Jocelyn. You're obsessed with Pier 1. You just don't want to admit it. These are adorable. They are hugging. They got little hearts. Yes. They're all one big happy family. Hand painted in China, but I do love them. For only $2.99, I'll grab those. All right, so I had skipped this aisle. I think it was a little too crowded for me. But we are back. 50 cents on the bottom. That's, that, that looks like a Salvation Army. And then it's $2.99. I do like the yellow, but the yellow is applied. I think I'm going to be picky on that. <laughs> I wanted to say these were candlesticks, but they're kind of weird because there's no area to inside. I don't know if they're supposed to hold like candle balls. Does it glow? I don't think so. I was thinking more recycled glass, but there's no way to like insert a oh. candle. Like, so does it hold the candle orbs? You know what I mean? Yeah. They're just kind of unusual, that's all. I was like, oh, candlestick. Wait, not a candlestick. Oh, I know what's happening here. Oh, what just now. happened? Now got Those are fairy lights. Look at that. Boom. Ta-da! <laughs> Everyone in the comments was screaming, Those are fairy lights! Bases, what are you doing? Don't worry, I got it. The more I looked at him, I'm like, wait a second. A few leprechauns here on the shelf. Right now I'm poking through the holiday stuff because I've had good luck in holiday in the past. Here we've got a female rose. This may have been a canister, but unfortunately the lid and I'm assuming it had a lid. The lid is gone. I mean, it would make it for a good um, utensil holder. But for $2.99, I don't think I'm willing to do that. This is really adorable. I don't see any damage on that. It's a little mouse. 99 cents. It's very kitschy. Grab the little kitschy guy. Looks like a few um, lighthouse. These are lamp finials and they are lighthouses. Those are pretty cool. Let's just go on the top of your lamp. I think I feel like those are worth at least 10 bucks a piece. I'll grab those. Here's Santa's Christmas list. It was actually accidentally donated to the Goodwill. Oh, there's addresses. Oh, I accidentally, I'll have to cut the addresses out of the video. What's from 2019? They could still live there if it was 2019. Mm -hmm. Also, look at this one. Ooh, that's Did you see me grab that? Look at that. Did you see your cat like reflexes? That's because I have cat like reflexes all the time. This is, this is great. That's a happy Halloween. Speaker on. Work. Here we have the Lennox Skating Bear. Now I wonder if it's in there. Also, how much is it? Because I feel like somebody opened it. Oh, three ninety nine. I'm gonna have to turn off the camera to get this one open. He's dated two thousand six. I found that the Lennox pieces that are dated to a specific date don't do as well as just the generic Lennox pieces. So I'm going to stick him back in his box. 
and leave him here on the shelf. But I'll move him forward. And uh, who knows, maybe somebody will come along and see Lennox and have a magical moment. Here are some fun Halloween books. The Old Witch and the Wizard, The Farmer and the Witch, <laughs> Weenie Witch. I think those might be fun for my children on Halloween. So I think I'll grab those. You're gonna get him down for me? He's super cold. Look at his face. He looks like he's missing something. He's got like this huge glob right there. Here. Oh, yours is better. There you go. <laughs> no, here, America. 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 That's, you know what? I feel like that's the best option. I like that. I like him a lot. Look at the back of his coat. It's pink. I like him. Does he pay for my shade? No, he's like a resin. No, he's like a clay. I like him. Okay. I think he'd do well in the booth, right? Oh, for yeah, Christmas. Definitely. Look, he could put some vintage somethings. Something right has there. to go here. Easily fixed. Like a maybe like a train. Oh yeah. Andrew has so many like vintage trains, I feel like. Oh yeah, he could hold it. A train could go there. Mm -hmm. That's easily. easily. I love him. Okay. Ah, that's my favorite find so far. I don't, there's not so, uh, no. Oh, I found that on the Christmas. He's sweet. I didn't think he was, wait, he's not, no, he's not broken. And then I got some Halloween books for. Old witch and a wizard. Very cute. I like him. Pick him up by his nose. I like him. We've got a ladle. Here. <laughs> And a strainer. Oh, it still has chocolate? <laughs> oh, man. I wonder if there's an expiration date on it. Not on that chocolate. That's, that's nuclear that's chocolate. The, that's the chocolate that left. <laughs> oh, shoot. That'll save me some money this that's Christmas like, for my kids. That's like the gum and the baseball card. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That never goes bad either. <laughs> I just noticed this little piece. I think this might be Peru. $1.99. I really like that. Little nativity scene. And then this was still in the box. This is Fitz and Floyd. It's a present. And the lid is there. Look at the lid. It says hand painted and everything. Fitz and Floyd in the box. Old World Santa lidded box. So it's pretty great. I found Fitz and Floyd. It was in the box. You're so like I said, I wasn't looking in the box, but I didn't even have to look in it. It just said FF, and I was like. You know, I totally missed that. I don't know how I did. He you looks... want to forget these nights. You don't want a statue reminding <laughs> you how tired you were. Remember that time back when little Alfie was... Not going to sleep. Not never going. And we put whiskey in his bottle just to <laughs> get a good night's sleep. <laughs> and there's some pegs. The graphics in one. that are just yeah. so neat. Even if it's not all there, like replacement parts. Maybe they are. Oh, it looks like you only need four. Oh, you're skilled. You only need three. I'm really just not that skilled. I think I would need more than three. So you have that. And back to the Sex in the City puzzle. I'm so glad they didn't. Are you gonna it. count? Hey. Oh, I don't think you need to count because I think all the pieces. I mean, that looks like original yes. packaging. The way this is. That's serious right there. Mmm. And they didn't even tape it shut. But not sponsored yet. Undo. <laughs> take that label right off. <laughs> I like it. Alright, let's check this. I don't think we did this one. It's that two in one light show. Do you need that? I think you need this. You could put it on your house. 
Oh, that. That these are neat. It's $15. Mm -hmm. 28 images included. How many of them do you need to make your house look pretty, though? Really, I don't want to draw attention to my house, though. So. In the pile, in the pile of stuff that's out on my porch. It is pretty cool. Yeah, I'll take it. Maybe I'll reconsider. You could do it in the back of your house. I could. The back, the back of my house is nice. I'd be the only one to enjoy it, but it would be worth it. I'll buy that for me. Alright, well our total spend here at the Goodwill today was right around $70. I'm not sure if it was $72, $74, somewhere around there. Uh, but I feel like we got some great stuff today. I was really pleased with that Santa, which obviously we're going to sell in our booth. But um, I feel like that was kind of my favorite thing that we found today, honestly. The Fitz and Floyd piece was also great because it was a present. We're coming up on Christmas. I think that'll also do very well. But uh, we got some good stuff today. Pleased with everything. I think we're going to definitely turn a profit on that, but we're going to get out of here now. We're going to head on somewhere we've never been before. Very excited for that. <laughs> it's really, it's actually really hot today. It's 94 degrees. It's October 15th in Pennsylvania. And it's 94 degrees. So anyway, we're going to head on down the road, check out someplace new. You guys have to wait for that video. And we'll see you later. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you spotted something you just can't live without, we do post 25 to 30 new items in our eBay shop every single day and I've posted a link to that down in the description.